Hey everyone, so um, I'm back. I'm going to be doing a shoe haul. And these are all the shoes that I've recently purchased uh, for the upcoming season and um, I'm really excited about them. Um, towards the end of the video, I'm also going to add on shoes that are not new that I've had for a while and um, I just think that they're kind of important to have and I've enjoyed wearing them so I'm going to share them with you guys. So I'm going to get started. Um, I'm going to start with my favorite shoes. Um, I've been looking for a pair of nude heels for such a long time and I finally found the pair that I could commit to. And it's these and they are a sling back platform heel. And I love the fact that they have like the connecting thing in the back. It just makes them a little bit unique. And they are uh, by Guess. And uh, I found these off of VictoriaSecret.com. They were also on ASOS.com, but they were a little bit more expensive on that website, so I got them through Victoria's Secret, and I think that's just because I'm in North America, so uh, maybe the ASOS website, you they have to import it or something like that, so it's a little bit more uh, for them, but yeah, uh, I guess that's like a, a little tip, like if you are looking for a specific shoe, just put it into a search engine and then compare your websites. That way you know that you're not getting like the most expensive price option, like you're getting the better deal for looking at the websites that carry it. I, that's what happened with this shoe. I wanted the Jessica Simpson clean backs, and I found them on multiple websites. Um, I bought these off of Nordstrom's. They had it for like half off or like 40% off or something like that. And they also had them on ShoeBuy.com, and I found them on the actual Jessica Simpson website. and. Like actually a lot of other places. I don't think you can get this particular color. I got it in Petunia um, so easily. I think you can still get the black ones fairly easily. I think I only know that because I want the pair of black ones too. Now the heel on this is a lot um, taller than any shoe that I own. Um, but because it is a platform, I don't notice it at all. They're actually one of my most comfortable pair of heels. And it makes me look really tall, and I, I just love this shoe, and I love purple, and so um, I have the perfect dress to wear with this, too, that I got off of Lulu's, but I, I'm excited to wear these. I like those a lot. Um, I will show you these. When I, when I um, got these, I didn't, I don't know. When you see boots, you probably don't really think, like, summertime or anything like that, but because like the floral prints and like the rompers and all that stuff are so in, I think that they look they would look so cute with with the pair of these or something similar to it. So I got a pair of boots. I got these off of gojane.com and I think I paid like thirty two dollars for them. They're really comfortable. They just have a small little heel and um, yeah, I like them. They'll serve their purpose. Um, I got a pair of sandals. I got these in, um, what is this, pewter? It's like a muted silver color. Um, one thing about this is, like, I don't zip it up all the way in the back because when you do, it, it rubs against my heel, so it bugs me. But I, these are really, like, soft, and they're comfortable, and I like them. I also got them in cognac, which is just this little guy right there. And um, one pair of shoes that I got that I was like kind of like not really happy with were these. I got these off of GoJane and they're really like not easy to bend and they're really heavy. And when I put my toe in between the thing, it just kind of bugs me. So I don't know, I think these are the cheapest pair of shoes that I'm going to show you. I think that they're like six dollars. So oh well. Um, I have a lot of heels, so if you don't wear heels a lot, this is probably not going to be a fun video for you guys. Um, I got these, and a story about these is I found a similar style on uh, Nordstrom's, and it was like $250 shoe. I think I paid like $30 for these, which they're a lot cheaper, like it's not like a high-end shoe or anything, but I love the look of it. Um, the front part I thought would be a lot nicer, but it's I feel a little bit like cardboard, and it feels a little cheap. But, I mean, no, I hopefully no one would come up and just, like, rub the front of my shoe and be like, that doesn't feel like suede. <laughs> that feels like cardboard. <laughs> so, hopefully that won't happen. Um, I think these shoes are so fun. It's not a shoe you would want to wear, like, 
a lot, but um, they have like the chain detail and the studded detail, and then they zip up in the back. Wear this like a concert or like out to a bar. I would wear this with like a t-shirt with like a pair of skinny jeans or something like that. I think it'd be really fun. And is that all my new shoes? I think that's all my new shoes. So I'm going to quickly just show you a pair of couple pairs of shoes that I love. I wear. I've, I've worn for years actually. Um, for sandals or flip flops, like the my go-to brand is Rainbows. I love Rainbows. Lifetime warranty. They form to your feet, so they're like so comfortable, and I love those. Um, uh, a workout shoe, hiking shoe. Um, walking shoe, like, I don't know. I love these. These are Vibram, and it says inside that it's like Merrill Continuum. Um, air cushion Q form. And, I don't know, the bottom just says Vibram. I got these in Banff, and I paid like $165 for them, and it was probably the best. My nails are really disgusting, by the way, like, horrifying. But, anyways. I love these shoes. I love running in these shoes. I love hiking in those shoes. Um, I think every girl needs a pair of red heels. And here's mine. I love these shoes. I don't remember where I got them. I know that they're at least two years old. So another pair of shoes that I got were these right here. Um, I got these quite a bit ago. Last summer, I guess. And they go around your ankle, and they're guests by Marciano. And they have these little... You see how I'm trying to hide my nails? <laughs> they have these, like, studded details in the front. I got these at Sears, and they were originally, like, 200-something dollars, and I got them for, like, 60% off, so I was really happy about those. Um, a pair of, like, dress sandals. I have these, like, wedges that are very small, and then this, like, little front part is, like, not like tiger's eye. I don't know what that stone is, but it, like, it's very, like, shiny. And I'm pretty sure I got these at Payless, but I like those a lot. For like a tennis shoe, like not like going and working out, but like a casual day, I like some of my like videos that I have, like um, my outfit of the day, like I don't like do like outfit of the days where it's like really fancy all the time. Like I kind of just do like what I wear. So um, I love these Pumas, like if that's like my shoe. I like those a lot. And, yeah, I think that's all my shoes. I mean, it's not all my shoes, but it's, like, my new shoes and, like, my favorite summer shoes. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I'm rambling at this point. I probably talked really, really fast. I apologize. Um, I had lots of coffee just a bit ago, so I'm, like, really, really wired. But I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.